Hey, what's up and welcome back everyone to the Iceman Isaac Academy, the second channel of the Warzone Academy dedicated specifically to coaching you every single day. In today's video, we're taking a look at a member from the community who has submitted their footage to me for me to review it. So what we're going to do is we're going to look through basically a little write-up that he gave that includes his KD, his strengths, his weaknesses, and then we're going to go through his gameplay and talk about how he can improve. If you guys want to submit your gameplay, you can do so via the Discord that'll be linked in the description and the pinned comment. If you're also looking for people to play with, you can search the Discord as well and join other members of the Warzone Academy inside of Caldera. But most importantly, if you guys are lear learning from these videos and enjoy the, enjoy the style of educational content, make sure to subscribe and like this video to help it get further into the algorithm. But without further ado, let's take a look at who we're taking a look at today. And it is 40 Fed. He has a 1.65 KD. Strengths. Gun skill strengths he watches a lot of Iceman Isaac so decent game sense he subbed a YouTube channel with notifications on nice John way to include that there yeah love that about you uh this is an understatement because John is my editor Boro Fed is my editor I'm going to refer to him as John in this video uh he's my editor so he watches an absurd amount of my gameplay everything that goes on YouTube weaknesses I almost never play with a team and when I do my normal squad not these guys they all have 0.75 KDs or less so I'm really bad about not trusting my teammates to kind of do my own thing uh, he's playing in this game actually with Yamat, another well-known member of the uh, Warzone Academy community. Uh, so he actually will have a little bit better teammates today than he's used to. Nothing wrong with being sub 0.75. You, everyone's got to learn, you know? Uh, his weaknesses is movement. He learned to slide cancel a day ago. Keep in mind, this is called Dara. And noticing small details and players in the open. Sweet. So this is a quads game with Yamat, a community member. Um, I've reviewed his solo gameplay in the past. He's interested to see what he could do differently in the end game to put the team in a better position. So he's open to criticism on how to be a better team player. Uh, Yamat, he wants to improve on how to be an IGL, but we're going to focus on John here today. So we're going to fast forward through a lot of stuff just to make uh, sure, village um, or lagoon? Be advised. Gas is you know, we're, we're not killing a lot of dead time, but we'll see kind of where they the want to land and what their lagoon, decision man. is. Ah, uh, lagoon Close landers. Okay. All right. I'm actually a huge fan of the dune. I'm a little bit low, but I'll get out of their way. Whenever you shoot. Okay, yeah, aim for the far one. Aim for the far one. Ideally, float for longer. Unless this guy is pulling a shoot, I try to like float for longer and get right on their cheeks. Pretty unlikely you're going to hit him from that way. distance, but I like it. Ruthless. Yeah, it's just one squad. Which? I'll be on the bridge. Nice. John's kind of like getting the pings for all his teammates to know where people are going to be landing. Wow. Wait, every time I open one of these, I get like an RPG and nothing. My man got a UAV, a dead silence, a gas mask, two big stacks, a car 98k. I'm getting scammed. That's a bad point. UAV, beginning flyover. Okay, back to one. Do it. I mean, I am not going to be useful for this. I got an... Yeah, All right, could... sweet. Everyone's hitting the regain. Uh, getting cash. Oh, okay, load Loadout drops. Uh, that might not be Four safe. Four boxes here. No. Holding your shots with an unsuppressed uh, sniper rifle while you're out in the field. Love that about you. I just bought back. My shredder. Enemy soldiers. I, I just bought back. Where? Flying in, good shots. I'm so blind. Enemy nice. Oh, another. A lot of people always ask why pros on aim down sight. I just bought back. It's a really good habit. Notice the player is completely out of his reticle, right? It's just like completely out of his that the glass. So he just unaim unaimed unaims down sight, recenters, gets the aim assist back, and then guns the player. In that, in that, in that well. belt. That team from the northwest, where we, which we were usually fighting, might might also have the loadout. All right, here. sweet. Risky play here. If I were you and I'm playing with an entire squad, obviously you're not used to trusting your teammates. That's one thing that we talked about. If I know there have been a whole bunch of gunfights right by this loadout, I would at least make the call. Hey, look over me. I'm grabbing my loadout. I forgot that these guys are dangerous when dropping in now. No, I forgot Jonathan. that these guys are dangerous. He goes for the automaton. This is pre-nerf. Battle hardened, which is pretty smart. High alert. Oh, and it's just a top break. I thought he was going for 
Yeah. I thought he was going for snake shots at first. Oh, I'm gonna go by UAV. Mark that vendor for you. Did you get? Oh, did you? And this I is dropped, the, the old, shredder. really yeah. bad shaker guns. ground. I got the shredder. Buying and popping UAV. We can buy another loadout back this way, and we can hey, grab I'm, I'm in, ghost. Yeah, I got him. I think it's a lot people loading on their loadout. John just keeps baiting people on the loadout. Yeah, no, we're going to be doing Academy vids uh, for at least the next hour or two, for sure. Okay, okay sweet. We're pushing yeah, in now. 100% I would UAV. If you have over $20,000 as a team, there's no reason you guys shouldn't be popping your UAVs. What I would say, though, is, you know, based off of this guy, he's on the high ground, right? So he's on the balcony outside of this garage, and the other guy's on the high ground over there. I wouldn't shoot this because it's just, just going to tell the entire world that you're coming, where otherwise they may not even know other than they're basically high. footsteps. Enemy soldier nearby. Oh, are they that? They're down low now? Tag one up a bit. Live ping. Coming up front. Three in there. The front door. Three in there now. So I would try not to do this. Three in there. Three. Peek the corner. Three in there now. Unaim down sight. Unless you know, like, you have a live ping or something. Like, let's take away the tunnel vision and then only snap down aim down sight when we know where someone's at. Yeah. See, like, if we were aim down sight, we would miss the fact that there's a player right here and a player just vaulted down here. He's, like, almost dead. They're all, all the bottom floor. Spotted floor. Them. Same or thing, like, uh, like we kind of talked about in the past. He's, yeah. If a player is way out of our scope... Explore. You're gonna get there a lot faster by unaim down sight, swing re-aim down sight, than you will dragging that scope. It's like almost dead. They're all all on the bottom floor. Great shots. Instantly fire. crouch back behind Try cover. Perfect use of cover. Last thing. Gets the thirst. Totally fine. Great use of cover. Spotting him running upstairs. Oh, Jonathan, you gotta capitalize, brother. Gas is closing in. So right here. Okay, great use of cover. That guy starts shooting at you. You get your head down. You get like three, four, five shots. This guy's maybe got like one plate or a fraction of a plate left. I would instantly switch my gun and start full sending on this guy. Fuck. And once he goes up, you know he's just going to have plates in hand, right? So try to capitalize on that because right now by doing this, you've allowed him to reset yeah, the fight and the again. advantage that you may have had. And the catwalk. Do it now. See, this is fine. This angle right here is fine when you're like pre-aiming down sight and you're clearing off a very set specific angle. But when you're trying to clear off an entire hangar, don't be oh. screwing yourself over like that. Enemy UAV active. Four. Oh, yeah, right, so you make the rotate dead. back around. Get the buyback. It's free, Jonathan. Buy them both back and get yourself a self and a UAV. Spots the guy behind. Gets the win. Good shot. Not quite a slide cancel, but hey, close enough. Instantly gets back under cover. Gets the high alert ping behind you. Nice. Nice. There it is. Hey, a little slow. A little slow. Great use getting back behind cover. Okay, you get the high alert ping that someone's coming right here. You, John? you also spot them right here. As soon as you get that high alert ping, you know this player is most likely going to be playing aggressive. Get into cover, which is the play that you make. Oh, I can't Come on. push my gun. I'm bad. Deep in the distance, deep in the distance, deep in the distance. Possibly bad. Alright, so anytime I'm running out, I'm always scanning where I would expect someone to come from, right? Because there's a buy station right here. So my scan pattern is focused on this gate right here this entire time. I'm not sure where your eyes are looking, but you should have spotted this player off here in the distance. But nice job getting into some cover. Oh, it was glitched. 
understand the other side of this wall. Enemy soldier nearby. Oh no, he's flying. He just fall out of the sky. Bait, 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 bait. Good. Shot. Do it. Nice. 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 On your right. Oh, right send. Oh, you're, you're getting the high alert from the down players. And the... Oh my god, yes, <laughs> John! Bye, 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 bye. Yeah. Just fall. Let's go, dude. Push my... Okay. So let me back it up a bit. As soon as I go around this corner, I'm assuming this guy's going to be chasing you. I would not play it. I would sit there and I would pre-aim that door because you've got a pretty disgusting Gun. head glitch. I was glitched. Okay, awesome. You end up making it through to here. This guy's shooting at you. You have no plate, so you might as well just play aggressive, right? What I would do is use this flash, flash over the top, and then repeak this angle right here and see if you can get him while he's flashed. Or if he's flashed, he's running, you can then reposition. The fact that they didn't communicate and you were able to do this is pretty disgusting. But you made the right decision. Good. Do it. You shot the guy on the that was running first, because this guy is going to be stuck in the syringing animation. You're able to get the down, nice. slide into cover, challenge aggressively. Oh like, my God. Said. Beautiful. That is not it. That is not a 1.6 KD player play. Good shot. <laughs> Good went, recoil control. It was kind of. And you get the full team bot back in. Yeah. Everyone regains, gets the loot, and now we start making rotations towards the next zone. Car. Car. Okay. Yeah. Broke his armor. One close. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Good burst yeah. fire yeah. for the recoil. Plating. Get the third. Precision. That precision, guys, on my blue pink. That's a really good con by Yamat. So whenever whenever someone hits a precision, they will show up on the map whether they're ghosted or not. That precision, guys, on my blue pink. Careful, there's a full team behind us. Yeah. Why did the the one in the car? Why did the yeah? This is kind of where you need to make an IGL decision, right? So we talk about in-game lead. You've thirsted one player here, but you've got at least three more somewhere over in this area. Now you've got a truck that's behind you being obnoxious. You've got a you've got a river you need to cross. Like this is where you need to be like, hey boys, we need to rotate right now. Come with me. We'll see if anyone steps up. Looks like you kind of make that decision. But you want to talk about in-game lead? This guy's looking back at a truck that has nothing to do with your team, and these guys are still focused on one player when you've got one minute left on the zone. You're making the right rotation, but tell your teammates to get involved. We'll need to reload. Enemy a little attacking. later, maybe. Yeah. Oh, is that the the planes? Get inside. I'm wrapping further. Nice job. Part You're here. clearing out the lower left where you expect the enemies to be coming from based off of the zone push. Holding, holding shots on the car. What was that team that was behind us? I got a pink behind me. Nice. So there's one behind us. He's good gasping it then. Good comms to your teammates that you got a high alert ping. I have no idea why you were getting spotted there. Huh? But it was that guy way deep in the gas. Nice shots. Once again, good burst fire. And Yamat cleans it up. Oh my god. This is gonna get him. Uh, I, yeah, I downed him. There's another guy down here? Oh. Oh my god. I think it was just the two of them. He's done, he's done. I downed him. Nice. To confirm. Moving. I wanna see how the end game goes, because you guys are you guys are cruising pretty well, minus, you know, one guy kind of ratting behind. Box for later if you need it. But we definitely had time there for Yamat to hit the res. Moving. Gas. Oh, jeez. Definitely had time for Yamat to hit the res there. What? I have maybe. 
I don't know. See in the house right? That enemy. Marking no. the I, Yeah, um, house. There's death here. So you're seeing shots I into this building? Going, this house. That's awesome, but if they're undercover, my focus isn't sitting here and wasting any time holding this. We always talk about the pinwheel rotation, right? But this is really damn close to the zone. So what I would want to do is instantly beeline over here to these shacks, get the early rotation, and then catch this guy having to rotate in. Watch but it looks enemy. like we waste quite a bit of time hanging around in here. Good shots. Nice use of the mount. Or just, you know, if anything happens, if one of you gets cracked up, now all of a sudden you, have, right to, you have to sit there. in the gas, the plate up. Let's rotate a Just little bit earlier right and get ahead of these guys. Oh, sorry. There's no reason to pull aggro when you're on the back oh, side of the zone. I broke him. Down. Yeah, see, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Green got stuck behind. Okay, in this oh, sorry. And that's also something you could do as an in-game lead, is letting people know, hey, no, we need to rotate, we need to get into the zone, we need to hold the power position, let's get in front of them and hold them. That's what you need to be saying as an in-game okay, lead. Now, all of a sudden, Cardinal is caught behind. Down. That guy's stuck in the gas. 100% dead. Oh, that's John. Copying behind me. Do you have a gas mask? Yes, I do. I do. I'm crawling. I got, I got the dude. Nice. Okay. Absolute hero play here on John's part to full send for the homies. Absolutely love that about him. Oh, He's going to go down again, but... All right. Yeah, yeah. Nice job on your mods part okay. to wipe the team. Sweet. Okay. okay. Everyone hit the regain. Just, just making that early wrap towards the left. I'm not challenging right here. Because my biggest thing is if I'm if I'm wasting time right here on this lower side, because there's a big hill right here. Okay, if I'm wasting time right here, that's gonna give time for this team to take the hill on us. So if I'm getting shot pot shots taken at me, I'm wrapping as hard as I can to the left. Yeah. You're trying to take that high ground from them. And that's exactly what Yamat's doing. Now you guys have a defensive position instead of giving up that high ground, which is good. I hear you delegating out, saying that you're going to watch the left. Got, got one. He's dead. Shots on blue ping. Across the peninsula. There's a way up, I think. They bought back at the buy. That would actually be a really dirty spot right there, like on that head glitch, would be kind of gross. Uh, it's not seven middle, uh, probably. We have a nice bridge line here. Yep, good call. Yep. I'm with. Says, hey, let's not sit in the middle. Let's make sure we have somewhere that we can hold. I think that's really smart. Yeah. Uh, this position right here is actually really nice. Because you've got this piece of rock that's allowing you to take fire from the left. And you've got the, obviously, hill to your right that's allowing you to hold the people to your right. This is a, this is a really nice spot to be. Shots. I got downed over there. Left. I downed one. Yep, come to us. Got him. He's, he's giving call outs. Oh, careful, careful, careful. Don't get so hungry for the thirst that Sun's you get taken down. out. You could get headshot sniped at any point here and your game is over. When you're on that hill and you get headshot sniped, you're back behind cover. But if you get thirsted here, like that is 100% GG's. Especially with this zone pole, I would not be pushing over the top of where Cardinal is. Unless you're just accepting Good. that risk, right? Team. Great play. He's using Tiger the tree for a little bit of cover. I don't I think you spotted the guy right here. You didn't. There's a guy right here inside of this doorway. Ten remaining. No, no, Muni. Oh, he's shooting at you. I'm taking fire. Back into the cover that you need. Beautiful. Yeah. Right on me. Not on me. On me. On me. On me. Right on me. I think. Covering fire, nice. I need, I need the, I need the tap. Not dead yet. Barrett, cover. Watch. Okay, make sure whenever you're saying watch the shed. I know you're playing on controller. If you can reach that left pointer finger up and just mark the shed, because there's you know different sheds that he could be watching. Just so you're really, really clear. Hey, this shed, this door, right? Because that, that that little bit of miscommunication could have cost you much. Yeah. When you started saying watch the shed, Yamat is still looking down at the beach. Right, me. Watching shed. Teams. Great comms on Cardinal to say, hey, watching Shed. Great confirmation players. call. But while Yamat is backing up, 
You need to be you need to be covering. There's no reason for you to be backing up right now. I'm taking fire. Right here. I'm falling back. Three other teams, five other players. If I were you, I would turn around and hold and kind of cover your mic because if your mic gets knocked, then it's, it, the whole thing is reset again. I'm taking fire. Right here. Nice. There's another to the east. Another east. So we've got four players left. We now have given up all of this high ground up here, which is fine. We just need to call that out and make another sure we're all on the same page. Us. In the shed yeah. still. I'm stunned. Absolutely. Up high on the ridge, right here. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely fantastic shots. You're committing to one of the angles, which is really smart. Yamat's holding a great angle. He's now isolated from these players, looking over the top of you. He's a buggy. He's I would, just, down. I would just stop making noise, John. You were safe. You were safe. Buggy. This right here is great. Stop making noise. They don't know you're there. He's a buggy. He's coming down. He's Yamat, help. Nice. I got your cover. He's not coming yet. Good cover from Yamat. You guys are setting up in a crossfire right now, him? basically. We're, you're watching Yamat's ass. Yamat is I'm watching yours. Here. Good push in. Nice. Nice. I'm safe. I'm safe. I'm safe. 2v2. Two two. Two. On the ridge. High ridge. High ridge. Above you. I'm sorry. I can't. On the right. On the right. Dang. Oh. Right. oh. oh. So this is, I mean, this is super tough, man. I'm trying to figure out, you know, how you really could have played that differently. I need, I need the, I need the tap. I, I think right after here, after this res, you maybe could have held a little bit more of a power position. When you might went down on that rock, that really slowed down your guys' power position and your pace. There's just a lot of angles to hold here, man. I think the big thing is once you got to here, you weren't in too bad of a spot. I'm plating. I think... Okay, let's look at Yamat's plate. He's, he's coming down. He's I got your cover. He's not. I'm wondering he's what took Yamat so long he's to shoot. He's, he's So he recognizes, right, at four seconds after. He's, he's coming down. He's And is, is that some of the first shots seven seconds later? Even if you're just pre-firing over the top of your opponent or your, your teammate, you could help him out. Nice pre-fire as you're able to get out. Got your cover. And He's then it's just super unlucky that that team yet. rotates on your high ground. You, you, you didn't have a gas mask to make any crazy rotations. I'm too. Nice. I'm safe. I'm safe. I'm safe. 2v2, v2. on the ridge, high ridge, high ridge. Above. And the zone pulled to them on the high ridge. I'm sorry, I can't. I would have snapped over to this guy first, but you're just, you're just kind of in a rough spot. Like, I think, was, I think that was a great rotation, a great fight. You guys were all communicating about the different angles that you should hold. Oh, nice. I think that was, I think that was definitely uh, a GG's. You guys were playing really well as a team. It looks like you cleaned up a lot of the kills. Almost gone the one. What do you guys think, chat? Would using stuns buy a little more time? Uh, there was a couple moments when I thought he could have used ridge, stuns. Right yeah. And he didn't have stuns, he had flashes. You might not be able to see that with Twitch quality. Um, right here. He's not going to throw a C4 that far, but he can chuck a pop stun over the top and take that guy out of the fight for five seconds. Stuns are crazy overpowered. There's another to the east. Another east. Having a fourth player definitely would have helped. For sure. Yeah. There's another to the east. Another east. The poor Cardinal, bro. Look how look how out of position Cardinal is. You guys are literally setting sending this man to the slaughter. Another east to us. In the shed yeah. still. I'm stunned. Up high on the ridge, right here. Yeah. Yeah, Cardinal was getting smoked, bro. Right yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, it may, it, if Cardinal, if you guys would have called like a retreat, because you and Yamat were on the same page with the retreat, 
but Cardinal was yeah. Cardinal was looking back to cover you on the ridge line while giving his backup to two people from the shed and the beach. It's just tough because up on that normally I'd say, oh, just maintain the high ground, but there's no cover up on that hill. There's like one tree up there that John was at earlier. Right? There's this literally just this one tree. Which had angles at him from the shed. Beach could have peeked up on him. These guys could have peeked up on him. It only was useful once the zone closed in to like right here. Good. That's just unlucky zone pull. I mean, it, it's not always the best to be in the power position early. They were in center zone, but they had three separate teams. Lower beach, shed, and uh, I don't even know what to call this workshop over here. All pushing on him. John has C4s to throw it above him. I mean, it's not season one war zone. You cannot just yeet C4s like you used to. I think a, a couple of things would have really helped yeah, with shit. being an in-game leader. Letting people know we need to rotate earlier. Cardinal died almost. John made a hero play in the gas. Uh, Incray, oh, Incray died so early, man. Just the one random guy back here. He's done. He's done. And with a little bit more awareness, we had plenty of time for Yamat to make it over here to the buy. And if Yamat would have got the buy, they they probably would have won that because they would have had all four up. Yeah. Uh, shots behind us near the car. Yeah, I think I think we, they needed someone playing this position. I think, like you mentioned, I think this is the the prime position for them to hold. And I don't think they had anyone there. You had Cardinal there later, I think. But I I don't, I don't even think Cardinal was there. I think Cardinal was like in no man's land. I can't really see where Cardinal's at. Yeah, so I would have wanted Cardinal right here, because then he can look over and catch that rotation over the top, and look over and catch this. Cardinal is stuck in no man's land. But yeah, man. I think it's a nice little breakdown. I think it's some good good gameplay. Yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like on it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And once again, you can submit your gameplay to the Discord. Make sure to follow all the instructions in the description. Make sure it's high quality. Make sure you've got good comms in there. And I don't want a highlight reel. I want learning coachable moments for videos like this. Hope you guys enjoy, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.